get it. I'm doing fine, how about you? Uh, how, how are you doing, Raj? Can I be mod, please? I don't know, fam. I don't know, we have lots of mods, and I don't feel like we have enough um, viewers to moderate to need more subs. Like, half of the time, you'll just see. You'll see, like, I don't know, 70% blue chat, like, a blue mod. Like right now, I'd say at least two or four, so that's half. Well, I'm one of them, so that's three of them. So that's 75%. We get more mods when we get more subs to moderate. <coughs> what are we at now? Chat, what are we at now? How many subs? I know you're not new, it's just we don't really have a need for subs just yet. I mean, for mods just yet, until we have more subs. Because as the community grows, obviously, we need more moderators. But right now, we have a couple hundred. I mean, what's one more gonna hurt, though, right? <laughs> I was hoping somebody would tell me where to drop. I've just been kind of blind dropping it. Do I believe in God? Not necessarily, but I... Let's just put it like this. I don't know what I'm supposed to believe in. Everyone has their own journey in life, and I'm still trying to see where my journey takes me, and leads me to. So, if it leads me to God, then it leads me to God. If it leads me to something else, then that's... that's I mean, if, if there is a God, then that's God's plan for me, you know what I mean? Yo, what's up, Mac? It's top 49, so if I touch ground right now, it's going to give me this, uh, this little thing for XP saying that, um, I got top 50 without landing. I think it should do that. Does it not do it? Does it not count off the, the launch pad? Or does it take it? Just supposed to be like a little XP thing. Yo, it's up Jack. That dog's going crazy. This dog's barking down. It's a chihuahua, she, she, she just loves to bark at everything. Chihuahuas are one of the most vocal canines out there, I believe. There are some other vocal ones, like really vocal ones, but out of all of them, chihuahuas are some of the most yap. They're known for that. They're like notorious for it. Yo, what's up, Aaron? 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 Aaron. I think the second way is the right way, right? A long. I don't know why I said it first. I've only met one Aaron. Aaron. Yeah, what do you guys think about, about my fit? I was gifted most of the fit right here, except for the back bling. What do you guys think? You guys liking the fit? For real though, you guys have to stop gifting me. I love, I love the gift. Don't get me wrong, but 
I'm over spoiled. You guys should be saving your V-Bucks for yourselves. Cause I don't have that much to like to give back. I wish I could, but I don't. Like it's actually too much gift. I've I've been gifted four skins recently um every single emote that you see inside my locker except for the sweaty emoji every single emote has been gifted to me recently as well it's too much i love it but it's too much Let's see what this message says Chat, I get you guys want to play. I get it. I get it. But can you just let me enjoy a match or two without worrying about none of that? Just let me let me play the game a little bit. When will I, when will I do a face reveal? I'm sure somebody else in the chat already knows the answer because I've, I've said this a bunch of times. Chat, would you guys mind telling Raj the answer? Y'all are crazy. I need at least a YouTube play button and a verified tick before I do something crazy like that. Look at what it does to someone like Dream, for example. A face reveal could go one of two ways. There's no, there's no like, there's no middle. It's either it goes left or it goes right. And the left is, um, is everyone hates the face reveal. You lose a bunch of fan base and whatever, just like Dream ha had, you know? Dream is like a big Minecraft player, if you guys don't know of him. Did face reveal. People didn't really like what they saw, because it wasn't what they was expecting or something. Or it just ruined the image that they had, like, developed over time. And then, you know, it could go the right way, where instead of left, it goes right, and people really like it, and it gives you a bunch more fans, grows the community even larger, and... It goes in a positive direction, but it's a risky thing because there's o only left and right. There's no middle ground. It's not like it just, you know, not go one of one way. It's going to go one of either way. No, I ain't ugly. It's just I'm self-conscious. I've got like 3,000 viewers. Or not viewers, but subscribers. That's like a lot of people to be showing my face to all at once. They might not all see it at once, but they're all eventually going to see it if I put it out there, right? I don't even have that many friends on Facebook. <laughs> Although I, I have some friends who have like a couple thousand friends, and I'm just thinking like, how the hell, bro? How the hell? You know what I'm saying? I've always kept my circles tight. No, it wasn't a statement, it was a question. He didn't call me ugly, he was saying, he was asking if I was scared. 
Because I think I'm ugly or some shit like that. Bro, that plane sounds like it's about to like hit something. Sounds a little a little too close for comfort. I'm just waiting for one of these days where where I hear the plane and it goes and then I hear the sound like of something like a whistle dropping, you know what I mean? Like that that whistle drop noise. Okay. Canada's been dumb lately, uh, in the world. We've been trying to shove our nose in a place where we don't belong. Shit happening across the world. Let it happen. It's not your shit to get involved in. If you get yourself involved in it, then you put yourself either in... You know, you put yourself in a box. Especially when it's something so controversial, you know I mean? Shit happening across the world. You got sides fighting, and you got half the world picking one side, half the world picking another side. It's not very good. I say, any of the countries that just stay back and let let everyone else do what they do, those are the smart ones. You just let them do what they do. It's sad to say, but there's just countries out there. Like, there's places out there in the world that are so much more- What the hell, you scared me. So much more prone to fight- fighting amongst themselves or even nearby civilizations and whatnot countries. And then there's just places that don't fight their own- Like, they don't fight because they don't have their own fights to fight. And they fight other people's fights. Like America, they just go in and fight other people's fights. Honestly, that's just... When was the last time they fought their own fight? To protect America? Probably Bin, bin Laden, right? Which one is it? It won't send fire now. Yeah, you guys know who Jimmy Neutron is? You know they did a collab episode one time with Fairly Odd Parents. Oh shit. CD, stop spamming in the chat, bro. I'm just camping right now.
I have no idea what chat's even talking about right now. I'm so confused. I gotta start doing some weights. <laughs> a little weight set going. I used to have some nice weights. I don't know what happened. I think we lost them during one of our moves. Or maybe it's in the storage unit somewhere. I do, I, I do leg day all the time. I just, I need to work on my, my like, my arms. Probably my back a little bit too. I need to get like, I need to get like one of them Asian ladies to walk on my back. You know the ones that like hold onto those ropes, and then, and then they like walk onto someone's back, and then they step on the backs. I don't like. I've never seen anyone not Asian do it. That's why I say it. It's not racist or anything. It's not stereotype. It's just the only people I've ever seen do that. I think it's like an Asian treatment. So. That's what I want. I want one of those Asian ladies to walk on my back. Nothing weird, just like walk on my back. It's like a type of massage. Cause my back is like Door, and I feel like I need someone to actually step on my back. I used to have a buddy, or I still have a buddy, it's just we don't we don't talk as much as we used to, but we still talk. But um my bro used to get me to actually step on his back every now and then. <laughs> I'd be at, I'd be at his place and he'd be all cramping up and I'd be like, Yo, you okay? And he's like, No, I need you to step on my back. Ah. What the hell, bro? I would let XD walk him up. That's crazy. No, when you step on the back, you just apply the pressure of your of your like of your weight. You know, what I mean, that's all it is. You're just applying the pressure of your weight, and you can hear like all the cracking underneath. You're not breaking no bones. You're just releasing all that like pressure, I guess. But yeah, no, I never understood why, like, how he could need me to step on his back like that until now when I'm actually wanting someone to step on my back.
scared. Why wouldn't you let me take that? God, I'm actually butt. I got the diamond too, at least. <sighs> nah, I fired her, bro. I fired her. Chat, spam F in the chat if you guys want me to rehire the text-to-speech woman. Her salary be expensive, but if you guys want it, whatever. Bro, she's got seven cats to feed. Her name is Linda. FF. F -F Skipping some comments. F. F. Now we're going back to Karen. Karen's a little cheaper. Bugs are not animals. Bugs are no animals. Bugs are no animals. Bugs are no animals. Oh. Hey, text to speech woman. What I hope you feed your seven cats. No, no, no that's Linda. Don't. We ain't hiring Linda back. This is Karen. Talk. 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 Hey.
How she finna feed her seven cats? Talk. Not my problem. And that's the story on how the uh, the crazy cat woman in The Simpsons became came to be. Talk. <laughs> Talk. I fired her from Talk. Texas Speech and she went Talk. to The Simpsons. Talk. The Talk. Cat lady. Talk. Skipping some comments. All right, no spamming. No spamming. Talk. 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 Talk dog. Karen has a very weird voice. Karen, don't be dissing on Karen. She got feelings, you know. I've got a feeling that tonight's gonna be a good night. Tonight's gonna be a good night. I need to go fishing. Get me out. Bro oh, forgot I had blade. five zero axe on it. It was a one minute timeout, calm down. It was just so Pull I can hear the whole spam. See? See, you're already back. You're already back. You're already Hi, son. back as the man in Calm back. down. Going back to the future. I don't know what rhymes with future. <laughs> I was gonna continue that, but I kind of dug a grave right there. How was your day? Bad, but good. How was your day, son? Good, but bad. If Marty kissed his mother in Back to the Future, would that mean he would have himself? <laughs> they have a movie. They have a movie. What's that movie called? Well, the movie is basically Son, where are like, you, Aran? like something like that, but weirder. It's like, dude is himself, his father, his mother, his brother, his dad. Like, he's everyone, bro. He's, what's it called? I forget exactly how it goes, because it's so messed up. No matter how many times you watch it, it takes so long to understand and to get it. Which I still have yet to do. I am in Ohio chilling with my bros Kabidi toilet. But no, they have a movie like that where dude is himself, he's also the prota protagonist, he's the bad guy. He's himself, he's the bad guy, he's his mother and his father or some shit like that. This, this is crazy. It makes no sense. You have to watch it a hundred times to understand it. If you go back in time to stop your grandfather from meeting your grandmother you would never be born. Doctor, if you were never born how did you? Okay, yeah, how Sigma does he still come to risk school? Probably just be born a different person. No, that Sigma graduated with the Ritzky degree. How would you go back in time if you were never born? Okay, blood. See you later, son. See, yeah. Here's the thing, right? So if if um. By that. See, here here's the thing, right? So if time travel would ever be commercially available, and you'd be by able to daddy. travel back in time. Here, hear me out. Listen, right? So if if you ever were to be allowed time travel in the future in your lifetime and it'd be commercially available to everyone, yourself included, 
I like how XD ignored my whole conversation with my daddy. Listen, if you if you have the ability to travel back in time, then if that was possible, then all you would have to do is set something on your calendar to mark to mark in the future to remember to go back to this exact day. By the so dude laugh, I got yourself. to go. And the fact that you don't see yourself there that day, like if you were to set the set the timer and actually do it without doing it, but do it, then hypothetically you'd you'd see yourself right then and there. You'd, you'd by Mackay the key. You'd be there. I'm dead. I told you. Mackie the key. Dude hopped off the train, bro. L. But think about it, yeah, all, all you would have to do is set, like, something in your calendar. To if you go back yourself. in time, will your present and past self be there, or will you replace your past self? Like, all you would have to do is remind yourself to go back to this very moment, to meet yourself in this very moment. If you reminded yourself of that, then you would see yourself in this very moment. You would see an aged, aged variant of yourself from whenever time travel would become commercially available if hypothetically hypothetically you could travel backwards through time now all that being said i don't see myself standing here in front of me just having this conversation and making this mental note telling myself that i should come visit myself on monday monday april 15 you know what i mean it's not happening What's up, Fresh Grizzly? We're talking about how time travel isn't uh, available within our lifetime, or at least not the ability to travel backwards through time. And if we only had that one-way ticket to travel forward through time, would you really want it? Like, if, if I told you you can travel through time, but you can only go forward, you can never go back. If a kid version time travels to the future and meets an adult version, will the adult remember his kid self meeting adult self? Because that means that once you go forward, you can't even go back to the point that you started from. you gone. You go 10 years in the future, you just lost 10 years. You might be able to see what it looks like 10 years from now, like at that very second, but... You just lost those 10 years that you'll never be able to get back. All your family's just grown older and all that Bro, kind of that stuff. is true. Everyone's just aged 10 years. Maybe you lost a couple people and you didn't even, like, you weren't there for it. You know what I mean? Because you're traveling through the space-time continuum. You just literally weren't there for it. Literally. Would you really do that? Like, would you hit that one-way ticket to travel forward through time? To see what it looks like like what if it's a thousand years in the future you just miss like all your family's dead now every single person you ever knew is gone i like, missed the midnight there. release of gta 6 at gamestop you know i mean you'd be able to see something that nobody else in your time would ever be able to see you'd be able to see what it looks like a thousand years in the future you'd be able to see that be the only one of your time to ever do that if you click that fast forward button, but you could never go back. That's something, something scary, kind of. You guys ever watch the movie Click with Adam Sandler? Because it's kind of like that. He's given like a universal remote, but he can't hit, re uh, he can't hit rewind. He can only fast forward. And every time he fast forwards, the, um, the remote eventually, like it fast forwards his life and the re remote eventually adapts to things that he fast forwards and programs that into Can you ready up? So no, anytime, let me search it. Anytime something that he would have fast forward would happen, it just automatically fast forwards. So he's losing so much of his like time. It's really sad. Like stop yapping bro. 
stop yapping. Ray Ray boy. I like yapping. It's my thing. Please, man, play the game. <laughs> Would you rather never die uh, or never be born? Never be born. Dot. If you never die, you will see the sun explode. Can I play rank with you? I subbed and like. I mean, if you never die, the sun exploding wouldn't affect you. You will be drifting in space forever without XD streams to entertain. No, if you live Okay, then do you, I guess, homie. You will, you will continuously, you won't just stay stationary in space. You're talking about a sun exploding? That's going to create some kind of force that's going to send you flying through space. You're going to go to another galaxy eventually. It might take you hundreds of thousands of years, but you got all of time. You're talking you're, you're, you're eternal, right? You never die. Then, I mean, you're eventually going to get to another planet. You're going to hit that planet, and you ain't going to die. You're going to get up and might not be um, a habitable planet, but you're going to be there. You're going to be stuck there until that planet's demise and then be sent flying through space again. And then the only time you would ever know of true loneliness is when everything in space expands too far from one another for you to ever be able to make it to anything. And you would just be stuck there in the darkness, the empty void of space. Because the universe is constantly expanding away from everything all at once. Things are just getting further and further from everything. What if there is alien life force and they want to breed? I don't even know what to do with that question. Cause that would be nasty. What if it's like some thick aliens, like, bro, we don't know what they look like. What if they evolve kind of similar to us, but even more thick or something? With better curves. What if every single one of them on that planet is a 10? I know that's not what it's like here. <laughs> got lots of uh, non tens. You got like threes out there. You got things that, out there that just make you question our species. What if Thanos excised and it takes him three billion years to charge the infinity stones to blow up the sun? Bruh. Is it just me or does Fortnite always make the islands in the back look so much more tempting to go to than the island that we're given? Like that one. I want to go to that one. Not this one. Or even that one. Like look at that. That's pretty cool. Or that one. Like... always been like that too ever since chapter one chapter one they really emphasized the outside. disney fortnite was like so the hyped and then world. even fortnite forgot about it like the outside back in chapter one you could see like a huge like a land mass far away like this huge land mass and it really just made you feel small like you're just stuck on this small island out in the middle of like nowhere Disney just wanted money. That's all it is. And not just that, but this is uh, the first 
season that the uh, the dude who took over for Donald Mustard, this is his first season to actually do something. So I'm sure that they're just waiting until next season before they do anything big with Disney. They're working on it right now. I'll tell you that much. They're working on it right now. And it might not be next season. It might take a season. If you were stuck in Fortnite, you could just live in a role play map. But, this but if you're hardcore, you play Battle Royale, so it has a win-win. This is his first time to shine with his first season that he owns. So they're gonna let him do his thing while everyone else is working on um, getting that Disney stuff ready, ready for launch. Cause you know Disney, they're perfectionists. They have to do it right, or they're not doing it. I'm pretty sure everyone here is going to agree with that statement. Actually, no. I mean, there's stuff that they've done wrong, though. Lots of stuff, especially recently. But in reflection to all the stuff that they've done wrong recently, there's, they've done try-hard mode to not let that stuff happen. Even more. Shit. Oh my fuck! Blue because ice cream does not have bones. What? <laughs> ice cream doesn't have <laughs> Y'all see me just shit on them? Let's get some W's in the chat, bro. I feel like that's the uh, elimination even Jack would be proud of. because rocks can't he use the toilet Green because pizza has flying legs. Mood again. Flying legs. Bro, just chill with the chat. I'm trying to actually play a game right here. Thank you. 
I thought it would be me. Purple because Fortnite is the charging port. He had such good loot and broke owned up. How was he in the ground? He had like no mat. I shouldn't have wasted all these hills. I'm gonna have to fix my mat situation. Dude's concerned maybe guy or something? I don't know, he's locked up, maybe he's gonna go too. Play smoke it off slowed it as a goaded song. Uh, I'm not trying to get copyright this stream, I'm just fixing monetization on I haven't been monetizing lately and I should be. Well play it in your free time. Try to get all the metabolisms. Slowed beats can T be copyrighted. So you can play it. Everything can be copyrighted, chat. Want his metabolism. Try to get all the Mandalorians. Oh yeah. Those Mandalorians are mine. If you win this game, I am unmodding myself. Not guaranteed.
was a lot of action. A bunch of people up there. Let me just grab that. You. 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 Get the greenish teal three headed dog Mandalorian. Mac, bro, you're really yapping. You're banned. No, why can't you talk? He has locked in MOG deaf person, MOG shushing face. Hold up, how am I banned? You disrespected Mac. Now you're going back. Just kidding. Bro, let me fuck you. Oh my god, of course. Why would it not let me match though? It's fucking retarded. Dang. Dang bro, you really scared me. MOG crying face. I knew that shit was gonna happen too. I was just making myself more visible. I'm trying to get up there. Not stay down here, jumping fucking up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Seriously, Dante, disrespect mods or else you are banned forever. Trying to tell me that that's too high for me to mantle? So that's BS. FR. I'm suing. Not actually, but mentally. I guess. I don't know. I have. I have presets for this? Huh. Don't remember from making that. Wait, I got. I am filing a lawsuit. I'm filing a lawsuit. Yo, I can listen to some coral. MOG speaking head, MOG fire, MOG oh, fire, oh. MOG fire. Add it, MOG speaking head, MOG fire. Yo, your rules when I joined stream said no swearing, you just did no disrespect. Yeah, no swearing for you guys.
I try to limit myself, but sometimes they slip out. Oh. But once one person starts swearing in the chat, then everybody sees that, and everybody That's starts fair. doing it, you know what I mean? Yeah, bro, only the top dog can swear. No, not even like that. I try to be better, so I can put a better example out there for you guys, but sometimes I make mistakes. So literally all it is. XD may be Canadian, but he is not so nice. M-O-G okay. Can't he hear you from I the coral buddies? Because I got eliminated and I was like, you know, it's just as bad as me saying darn or dang or or shoot or something. Facts. It's just those aren't the words that came out. It's unfortunately the one that people frown upon. But it's an expressive word, you know. It's one of those words that have like like a thousand different meanings depending on how it's said. You know what I mean? It's an emphasis word as well. You know what I mean? It's an expressive word and it's an emphasis word. So many different meanings to the F word. You know what I mean? Like, if I say, that's awesome, you're like, hey, that's awesome. But if I say, that's effing awesome, then you're like, hey, that's effing awesome. You know what I mean? It's an emphasis word, but it's all about context and also, I mean, when you're younger, obviously you don't want to- Dang it flip you, you nice guy, why are you so bad at this freaking game? You know what I mean? You don't want to swear around your elders, just because that's impolite, and you have to respect that, whether or not you understand it or not, but like, that's just, I mean, it's what you would rather when you get older, trust me. You don't want to hear no kid cussing at you, or towards you, even if it's not convenient to you, you don't want to hear no kid cussing. Do a fashion show, MOG dress, MOG dress, MOG person walking, MOG person walking. Do a fashion show? What is up with everyone with these fashion shows? It is only me and you, Amy. How are we going to do that? Turn down the music a bit. No. I My can't dad. hear. It's actually making me want to go to the beach, but the weather's not permitting. I mean, I could, but it's just not going to be nice. My right eardrum is bleeding. It's crazy. <laughs> I'm tired. Dang. Ding dong. Who's ding dong in? That's sad. I am going to Florida in a week, so I am going to the beach. Well, aren't you lucky? I live up here in Canada where shit's still not nice yet. Still waiting for the nice weather. Lucky. And I am bringing a speaker so Coral Chorus is gonna be my go-to song. M.O.G. Speaking Head. M.O.G. Fire.
Oh, I just thought of something. I just thought of something cool that we could do in the Discord. I could get everybody to do a setup reveal or something like that. And then I could like, uh, I could do- I am in Canada too. I am just going to Florida to visit family and go to the beach. Like I could do reactions to each setup, you know what I mean? You won't see my face reacting or nothing, but you can hear my vocal reactions. I do a voiceover. Boom bada bing. Cause I want to find more ways to engage with the Discord platform. Cause I like, I like that we're getting more people to join it. I just don't feel like I'm doing enough to engage with them. That dude do a freestyle. Oh shit, out of nowhere like that. Um, usually I just let my freaking randomness I can edit a video for you anytime I start rhyming it's usually just literal sporadicness you can't be put on the spot I don't know I just I can't do it I'm not like that bro definitely not like that Turn up your sound, MOG speaker high volume, MOG speaker high volume, MOG speaker high volume, MOG speaker high volume, MOG speaker high volume. If you record a setup reaction vid send it to me and ILL cook up an edited vid for you. I would do anything for you. Well I need some thumbnails, that's something I'm needing. I need somebody to make me some thumbnails and just send me send me them on Discord, DM me them. Pretty sure you can copy stuff in Discord, right? Copy or download an image, I would hope. Pause. Instagram, you can't do that for some reason. But yeah, no, my thumbnails, they butt. MOG pause button. I can make thumbnails, edit videos, and I can make money, but for you, ILL, do it for free. Double it. You pause, MOG pause button. Pause what? I don't know what you're talking about, fam. Guys, smash that like button. That way we can get more people. Hopefully to No, but for real, if you ever need a thumbnail maker and video editor in your guy. I mean, just the thumbnails is good for now. I can do editing some sometimes. Not the best editing, but good enough for now. How about this, Mac? If you want to show me what you could do with editing, W Mans. Grab grab some of my videos, like some of my clips. Download them. Sh like, I don't know, put together some kind of montage with the stuff that's already out there that you can, that you can grab. And, um, yeah, make a montage, show me, show me what you can do. Show me what you can do, I'll do a reaction to that, probably, if it's reactable. And then, boom. If I like it, then, yeah, I'll take you. But if I don't, then... I'm still gonna have to be in search of a... I will cook a meal for you, I promise. I wouldn't mind having a couple editors, to be honest. Shoot, if I could get, like, a whole little group together, then I'll make, like, a whole separate Discord group just for, like, um... 
for like the team because it would be different people that I would want to get in there be like shoot I, w I want to eventually just get somebody to run my whole schedule you tell me what to do and I'll do it like a manager kind of like I still want to be in charge of my life of course but it'd be cool to have like someone doing shit for me like that Coordinating team going, freaking editing, editing team, freaking thumbnail team, all that kind of stuff. Sub my G. It's actually a really good idea because then the editors can can collaborate and work together on stuff in the Discord. And then same thing with all the other people. Is that a llama? That really looks like a llama in the tree. Do you guys see that right, right there, there, there? There, there, there. It's a llama. It's a llama. I got a pretty good eye for those. I swear. Do I ride him? I'm gonna ride him. Just a casual day in Fortnite. Let's go. Chilling on top of this llama. Gotta love it. Usually Fortnite's bugs be like making me hate on them, but this is this is cool. I like it. What's the odds somebody sees this llama sitting in the sky and then sees me on top of the llama and then kills me? What's the odds? Like, out of ten. Yo, what's up, Sam Sam? Should I open the llama? I'm gonna fall into the boat. No, I'm not. I might take a little bit of fall damage. I don't know if this is enough to kill me. I'm pretty high up. Chat, what do I do? What do I do? have falling physics I thought I was gonna fall while staying on the llama and everything like gravity and stuff whoa um chat whoa. Chat. 
<laughs> what is happening? I'm so confused. <laughs> what? Why is chat so quiet right now? This, this is something I want somebody, like, anybody say something. Hello guys, it is Mac. I am editing a montage for XD so like and subscribe so he thinks it is cool. Mac, what the hell is happening? The, the, I'm on a llama. I'm on a llama. I'm stuck. And I jump and I'm down here. And then I'm up here. And then I'm down here. And then I'm up. And then I'm down. And then I'm up. And then I'm down. And then I'm up. What the freak? Can somebody react to this? I, I, like, nobody in the chat's reacting to what the hell's happening. This is something that people should be talking about. This is so cur cursed. Bro. Where am I up? Am I even up here? Or am I down there? It is like that glitch where you landed on something in the sky in chapter 1 where you would go from dusty to please end. Nah, this is cursed. If I just keep doing this, am I actually teleporting right now? If I just keep jumping, is that making it like impossible for me to get killed? I'm going from down there to up here to down there to up here to down there to up here to down there to, 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 to up here. It's too bad they don't let you send uh, like a recording to Fortnite. Instead, they only let you send a screenshot, so it would be impossible for me to show the The llama will not let you leave. a replay on this. That was weird, bro. That was weird. Yo. Yo. I can get you a win. You was up. Easy. To be honest. Baba. Yeah. How you doing? Jackie. Alex. What is up, y'all? I clipped a Dante worry smile. I'm trying to see inside of here, bro. That shit was weird. This isn't the match, is it? No, this is. I think. I don't know. What the heck? <laughs> oh 
Oh my god. <laughs> what? That is actually crazy. I want to see what other dudes seen. Where's a good angle? I think he came up from that way, right? Would you be interested in custom graphics for your stream like banners, logos, be right back, screens, overlays, at? It's like I'm two places at once. Let's watch at normal speed. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. Hi. That's weird. Jamie, watch this cursed game, bro. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Watch this. I'm up there, I'm down there. I'm up here, I'm down there. I'm up here, I'm down there. Here, let me slow it down. Okay. Down there, up there. I'm everywhere, bro. How can I be two places at once? And I'm on a floating llama, too. And then he comes up and kills the bottom one. But then XD, the my one YouTube glitched one yesterday and my mods disappeared. Alright, you keep saying the same thing over and over and over again. You're, you're never coming into the chat and actually chatting. You're just probably wanting mod for nefarious purposes. I can't actually guarantee that you are who you're saying that you are haven't played with you since like I don't know a week or two kind of suspicious and all you do is spam the same thing over and over and over again how do I know that you are in fact CD goat not just somebody who put CD goat on their name trying to get mod That match was dumb. Banners, logos, be right back, screens, overlays, etc. I don't even know how to implement any of that stuff with PlayStation, which is what I stream with. I wouldn't know how to implement none of that stuff. Yeah. So confusing. You need like a third party software and it's not like I'm gonna give people access to my account so then they can manage that. It would be way too much trust. So you can make all the stuff in the world but I wouldn't know how to implement those things into my actual streams or my videos. Well, video is probably easier, but stream is not so much. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Jamie? Jamie, 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 Jamie. What about your brother?
it's not like I'm in a big rush to do any of that kind of stuff and get like overlays or whatever. Give suggestions. You in back. Welcome back. You guys think I can get to a leaf by the end of the day? I'm like 25% into diamond 2 at the moment. Bye, gotta go. Early. Still pretty early. You gotta go, take it easy. I don't know. Not sure. Where should I land? Chat. <clears throat> chat. Anybody in the chat like fishing? I'll take that as a no. Personally, I, I, I love fishing. It's like that patience game. It gives you like this rush of adrenaline when you got that fish on the line or when you're getting some bite. Or when you get that fish on the line and you're, you're fighting to reel it in and you try not to lose it and unhook it. And the adrenaline when you're pulling it out the water, grabbing it by the gills, weighing it. I think he's looking for me. I am currently editing the vid. I just started. Should take about a couple hours.
Oh, I just thought of something. Next time I go camping, I might just bring like some stuff to make some cookies, like, like some pre-made cookies and stuff. Shove that in the cooler so then it doesn't like get too hot or whatever. And then when we get there, we can have cookies on the fire, which is something I never even thought to do. But that would be like amazing, I think. Cookies on the fire. It would be like the most homemade cookie that you could possibly do. Because I make cookies from scratch usually. Unless it's like peanut butter cookies because then I'm, I'm not making my own peanut butter. That's a little bit too much work. Actually not that much work to be honest, but... Shoot, I wonder how much that would make a difference. Making your own peanut butter and then making cookies with that? That sounds good. But yeah, no, make some like cookies that would go good on the fire. Like some s'more inspired cookies. Some s'mores inspired cookies. Baked on the open fire. You'd have to find some way to like close off it so it could bake properly, not just cook from the bottom of the bake all the way through. So just like close it somehow and then boom. Cookies on the fire. Like an old school way, you just bury it with a bunch of ambers. I'm trying to think of probably like a skillet and you wrap that skillet with a bunch of foil and then you bury that in the embers yeah that would work a big big skillet cookie and then you divide the skillet cookie oh yes skillets more cookie If we go camping soon, it's going to be the perfect time to tap some trees. Not in a weird way. <laughs> but the maple trees, they'll be giving lots of staff around now. There ain't gonna be no berries to pick though. That's gonna be a downside if we go this early. Camping. I really want to go camping. I'd like to pick enough berries while camping. To make like a nice fresh jam over the fire, like a nice jam, fire jam. That'd be cool. I want to make a whole meal just of food that I can find while camping catch a fish, you take that fish, you find some like stuff, like some herbs in the forest or something, some edible mushrooms.
think he's friendly. Him marks what the hell? Blood, blood, blood's crazy like that. Oh snap! You what's up? Yo, what's up? How you doing? Good. How about yourself? How you doing? Thinking about taking a small break from Fortnite, refreshing a bit, and then maybe stepping back and playing more Fortnite after and streaming it. But I'm gonna take a break for now. Got the Diamond 2, 21%, that's not too shabby. I was at Diamond 1 earlier, so it's a good little advancement for how long I've been playing for. Play more later, probably get Diamond 3. But yeah, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys next time. Peace.